where are we? Well, we're on the top of the road here, and the traffic's pretty bad. It's just taking me about 30 minutes to get from our house to here. I'm heading to Todmorden. Even I couldn't get lost on this route. All you do is just follow this road. In trouble with this uh, cyclometer. See, it froze a bit since, and now it's turned off. It's turned off completely, so I don't know what's going on with it. It's acting the goat, as they say in the north. against the wind and all. Oh yes, it's windy. I've been going against the wind and I'm talking about real windy ever since I left our room, our house. Yeah, look at the trees, they're hardly moving aren't they? You can probably hear it blowing past the camera. What's going on with this? The trees aren't moving, yet it's really windy. I mean, some sort of uh, optical illusion here, or you know what? Gale close, well it feels like it's blowing a gale, but the trees aren't moving at all. Well, you can hardly hear me speaking here, can you? I were having problems with my belly. Well, you can see these breeze, please. This. <laughs> you can see these leaves blowing about. One police car with the flashing lights, but no siren going. Oh! Well, I wonder what they're racing to. Perhaps somebody's found a bit of asbestos in somebody's house, eh? Oh, cool call for the fire brigade. Oh, God. Asbestos. Oh, yes, going right against the wind and I'm going uphill. What's the betting? When I'm coming back, it's changed directions. Well, you might think, have I, I got some new handlebar grips? See that? And that? Well, no, I haven't. I've just, uh, I've just cleaned them. They were absolutely filthy.
Yeah, I had to use uh, Jith on a toothbrush and scrub them and scrub them and scrub them. Oh, we've got a railway line down there, which I take it it goes to Tobin in that. This is still Rochdale, or the top end of the uh, Littleborough. Nine view, I've worked down there. One of that says shower. Yeah, that were a job to remember. Yes, we're still in Rochdale. Surprising just how far out it is, Rochdale. Although Littleborough, like most places, was a town all of its own at one time. Like Shaw and Royton. the summit pub well when I come back I'm going to turn left I'm going to turn left and go down that road there uh, there's a reservoir down there I hope to finish up that It must be fitter than me. <laughs> and I'm on an electric bike here. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh look here, it's gone it's gone again this. Well it's keeping the time. It just keeps switching off. According to that, I've done seven tenths of a mile. According to my bus speed, I've done eight, I think. Eight plus maybe. Look how far he's got now. And there's Rochdale Canal. Now there is a tow path along there, but it would take too long to get where I'm going. And here we are. I think this is the end of it. Welcome to Calderdale. Oh, here we are, Tob Medin. Yes. Where are you? Well, he overtook me on that bike. A lightweight sports bike. I mean, they go on about electric bikes. All the dangerous people flying around all over on them. No, they're not. Yeah, if you watch my uh, Marsden View 
car park and back video I got overtaken and burnt off by loads of ordinary bikes because after 17 mile per hour it won't go any faster this but people are dead ignorant about this they think you've got a throttle and it, there's no limit to how fast you can go and not the case so we've got to keep our eye on that speed or now Put it around five six six knot when I set off. Well, it's about twelve miles this to this place. The trouble I've got is it's an heavy bike and it's as well so once you've got past roughly this speed I'm going at now it won't go any faster the motor's not helping me anymore and don't I know it yeah it's nice around here Colder deal. Yeah, well, the last census, uh, let's see now, the population of Colder deal, now bear in mind, the population of Oldham was about 265,000 people. Uh, topping in, it said 6,500. How about that? That is a big difference, isn't it? I think this wind's a bit backwards and forwards at the moment. So when I get to where I'm going, before I get there, I've got to turn up, turn right off the main street and go up this really steep long hill to give Buckstones Road a bit of a run for its money. It's not as long as Buckstones Road, but it is a steep, it's about half a mile I think, right up to this bungalow. The estate agents are coming around today, they're pricing it, and I'm going to go up there and just walk around it with a camera and show you what it's like so the first price was 195,000 the second was 190 so we'll see we've got somebody else coming in all this afternoon I think it's half past three and it is half past one well I set off at quarter to one so I've been going now about three quarters of an hour so I told him I'd be there, uh, I told him about quarter past two. So I'm, I, I think I might be there before then. That's, this last bit might slow me down a bit. Now, I've got a plate against the crank wheel and for some reason it's bent and I'm wondering whether the thudding noise I keep getting every now and again is the chain going past this where it's denting in I don't know how it's happened that Oh, we're still a bit off yet You might think this is it but it's not Another couple of miles yet, I think. I think we leave this little town and it's more countryside again and then, then it's the centre of top of it. That's garden rigs there, look. The garden centre. Well, it's a nice day, this. 
I mean the weather has been absolutely diabolical I've hardly been out on this bike at all Oh, I'm right in it now, this wind. Not doing so bad doing this speed. Well, With a drink, I've got a, I've got a drink with me. I'll uh, I might stop in a bit. Although I might just keep going till I get there. I'm not far off now. now well going back it's generally more downhill and I should have the wind behind me I should have so I should be better progress you see you're looking at this on your screen and it might look as wrong going along with the fair lick but for some reason the GoPro makes it look as I'm going faster than I am now the windiest camera didn't I mean camera for camera that windiest it was only 50 quid and it, were, it weren't bad for the money but it's expired completely now the batteries have gone and last time I managed to get some life out of it it wouldn't have uh, I couldn't get it to go into menu. I couldn't delete the film off the off the uh, memory stick card. I've still got it in the cupboard, but well, I've had my money's worth out of that. I think there's a big viaduct here on this bend with loads of weeds and bits of trees growing out of it. Here we are. Knowles Wood Bottom, that bit it's called there. Yeah, look at that, eh? It must be that train line, that. Town centre down here. Well, I must say I'm doing all right here. Oh no! Oh yes! Oh, that was lucky. But I've got to come back, haven't I? What are they doing there? Now, it's two weeks since I came up here, in the car, and those roadworks were there then, and they're still here. I'm sure that it's a government incentive to make motorist lives a misery. The more roadworks there are, the more the government like it. Because it gets... Well, I'll not say what I want to say. I'll just say it gets a little bit weary of it all. 
Ah, straight. Oh, not far off now. Oh, the wind is really howling. Yeah, look at weeds, they're not moving. Going on. So that's that's about 12 miles now I've done. Morrison's. Well, we did, they were a very good fried dinner or breakfast, but it's not that dear because we went there first time we came across to have a look at the bungalow. So he uh, he bought it to do it up. I'll try and uh, I'll try and film it and show you later on. It's in a lovely spot, this bungalow. Right now then. Now there now. Aha. Longfield Road. This is what I'm after here. Yep, let's go up there. No, no. This is the one. Oh yes. No, I'm in tour at the moment. So I'm going to put it in turbo and second gear. Well, this isn't too bad, this bit. I'm not doing too bad, it's only 22. Not been going an hour yet. Yeah. Cliff Villas. Some funny there's some funny feelings going through these pedals. Can you hear it? Moment, you pedal so many three pedals you do, and then there's a thud. Now, then, well, I think we'll drop it into first. This is a real estate little bit there. Far off now. Oh, it started working again. This it keeps waking up. Electric power, eh? <laughs> it's still hard work. Come up there in the car. It'll just make it in third gear. That little feet and seat me. So there you are. We made it. Here it is. There's the familiar red van. And there we are. For sale. Take it around the back of the van. Yeah. 
Yeah, so uh, six one four rise for sale. Nice views. Well, I don't know where it is. And that's the back. Okay. Right, so finally done up for sale eh? so we'll just have a, a quick look around it now if you had smell of vision it, it smells really nice in here it's like all brand new this is the, uh, the front bedroom uh, all the radiators are brand new all redecorated this is the main bedroom Nice view out to there, look. All new radiators, new doors, all the doors are new. Uh, got your bathroom here. All refurbished. New radiator. New floor, new ceiling. All neatly done. A nice uh, shower there. No expenses, set spurred here. <laughs> and then we've got the kitchen. It's just lighting in here. Everything's brand new in here. New floor. Yeah. All new. New oven and all. Yeah, so that's all right, isn't it? So, uh, right. There we are. So let's uh, let's just go up to the end again. Yeah, those waste pipes are what uh, I painted, aren't they, Matthew? <laughs> yeah, we've done the uh, painted the fascia board and gutters and all, and hanging baskets of uh, via Matthew. So we've got to tidy the garden up here. So this this is uh, this drive belongs to this bungalow here, so that's that's a good point, isn't it? Right then. So there we are. So how much do you think it'll be? 195 do you think? Yep, okay. So let's go back now. So I'm going to go down into Littleborough, I'll turn the camera off, but when we get to the summit pub, I'm going to turn it back on again and turn left, and I'm going to try and find a reservoir, and then I'll finish the film there. Get the brakes a bit hot. Right, so I've had to resort to putting this bus trip back to north now. Because this doesn't work, it's froze, I don't know what the hell's up with it. It keeps going to sleep and waking up and it's such a finicky thing this. When it's working it's great. But then it's have its off moments, doesn't it? Yes. I'd like to move to that bungalow myself, it's in a really nice spot with it, great views. It's got a really nice feeling there. But the trouble is, it's just a bit too far away. We'd have to keep going backwards and forwards down top of him road. And have to do our heads in.
Right, I'll turn the camera off now, we'll see you at the sun. Well, I told you the wind had changed direction, didn't I? I'm cycling back against the wind. Can you believe that? I tell you, it's always had it in for me, the wind. So to shake them were well I can't believe it I'm I'm actually pedaling against the wind again I told you to change round didn't I listen to that God blowing a gale there's the canal look see I could have come back on that but it's a bit slower Welcome to Littleborough. Now there's an old abandoned mill somewhere along here. I'll turn the camera off and I'm back on again when I get to it. Summit, hold on. Left turn here. Now, this looks like a car park entrance, but in actual fact, it is. Hey, up. Now the strange thing about it is, the Google Street car doesn't come along here. Do you know, I'm not even sure of what this reservoir is called. I've had a look on Google Maps. And uh, it didn't put an actual name on it. Well, it must have a name, mustn't it? Well, well it's no wonder the Google car doesn't come up here, isn't it? Oh, the heat. Oh, I didn't expect this. Hey. No, I didn't. Well, I wonder if that's it up there. That could be the dam to it. Burn Reservoir, that'll be that one. <sighs> 226 people accidentally drowned when <sighs> oh.
Well, the wind's blowing up here. At least the sun's shining. Well, my guess is that's the dam holding back God knows how much water. And the road goes up to the right here and then I think it fizzles out. I see the thing. Got a minute, got a minute. Oh, what can they see? This is steeper than it looks. Running turbo now. Well, I don't know, a lock gate, typical. Well, let's have a look here. Take the camera out of its holder, hold it up. You just about see the reservoir. Well, the camera can see more than I can see. Oh, right, so, you see again, you look at the map, it all looks pretty flat. Yeah, but I suppose you could say they don't build reservoirs at the bottom of valleys, do they? Well, before I set off back now, I want to have a drink. Well, now I didn't see that old mill, but it is along that road somewhere, it could be further along. So I'm going to turn the camera off to save the battery and I'll turn it on back on the main road. Now this is typical isn't it? I'm going downhill and I've got the wind behind me. You know, what can you do? Right, now then. this mill well it, it seems to have been a lot of uphill so far you won't think that from going from Tommy into Littlebury but this is downhill but the winds change directions as I said before yes it's got it in for me isn't it? now this mill should be somewhere on the left I've had a look at it on Google Maps and, well where is it No, it's gone. Don't know. Where the hell is it? Oh. Well, hang on. So I've just pedalled back up here to look for this big mill. It's a big old mill on the right other side of the canal and I can't see it. I found it really easily on Google Street Maps. Well, I don't think it's any further down there. I don't understand this at all. Right, let's uh... Oh, I'll have to go back, won't I? Don't understand this. here. The mill is here. 
So I've turned back, done looking for it, I've convinced it was further up there but it's not, it's here. Now look at this place, I'll just get... I think I'll stop here and I'll turn the camera off. I thought I was seeing things. Yeah, there it is. There's the railway line. And over there is the canal. And that old mill there. Now you'd think somebody would be interested in preserving that. It's a stone mill. Oh, and there's a train going past, just to prove the point. Yeah. So there you are. Well, I don't know. Well, I thought I were imagining things. So it is actually in Rochdale, this mill. Well, I've been going 40 minutes now and I'm only here. Right. Off we go again. Well, I'll keep the camera rolling and uh, till it beeps and runs out. Okay. See along here, in it really. I'm on the pavement here. I shouldn't be, but 